Yeah, the global day of unplugging is tomorrow, and ahead of it, we are learning how to have some unplugged family fun with screen-free toys, games, and activities. James Zahn, senior editor of The Toy Insider, joins us now with all the details. Welcome! Hello, thanks Hello. for having me. I love alternatives because, you know, sometimes you have little or kids, it's hard to play board games. Mm -hmm. Yes, so we're going to go with little kids and big kids. Perfect. So we have all kinds of stuff. We're going to start with something classic but new. Okay. That is Light Bright HD. That is the Pokemon edition. Oh, so right. Pokemon is so hot, gotta yeah, catch them all. Love it. Yeah. Yes. They actually, so they came out with a Pokemon one. There's also a Barbie one you oh, can get, oh. but they have a super bright screen, and that is classic play. You know, plug in the pegs. I think okay. I, it's very satisfying. It is oh, so yes. satisfying. It was satisfying before satisfying <laughs> right. was a thing. Exactly. <laughs> all right, now this is kind of like one of those things you just sit there and stare at. Like, yeah. Ooh. This is awesome. This is from Fat Brain Toys. This is called Air Tubes. Okay. Yeah. This can be constructed in many different ways, and you kind of play with it. It's kind of like going to the bank. You put your thing in the envelope, it goes up and around. Mm -hmm. But you're going to learn about velocity and speed. You can turn this. Uh, oh, you can turn it up. You can turn the dial. Oh, yeah. Oh. If we do that, we're going to shoot these all over the place. Okay, but that sounds fun. There we go. It's like a survivor game, I feel like. We're gonna crank it up, but this is a this is a rechargeable unit, oh, and it actually so comes with a lot more pieces than what we've got here on display with us. Mm -hmm. So kids and adults can have a lot that's of fun, fun with that. Yeah, oh, that's really nice. Yeah. Yeah. And you can, okay, yeah, awesome. all those pieces there. Okay, R two D two. This is the droid you're looking for. Yeah. You know, Star Wars speak here. So this actually comes out tomorrow. We're one of the first places you get to see this. That's so cool. They're celebrating 25 years of Lego Star Wars. So 1999, when the Phantom Menace came out, they released the first set. So now they're revisiting some old characters. And we've got R2-D2. Oh, awesome. okay. My little nephew Henry helped me put that together. It took us about four hours. And he's wow. a leap day baby. Good. So today is his okay. birthday. Oh, happy birthday, Does this Henry. Uh, it is... Uh, interactive so it's got different moving pieces okay. these panels come off you can add different pieces on it so mm -hmm. play and display okay like all that. right fun that's time. cool all right this is a game yeah. Amy and I are very oh. familiar with pickleball is all okay. the rage yeah. this is pickleball blast i'm going to get out of the way this is from moose games am the, i able to block her the idea you I certainly so, yeah. can you know um this is, this is where you get, you know, the Ooh. delightful game of all this stuff. You can break out all the dill, the dill puns, you know, oh. all the pickle stuff. Big dill energy coming out on the oh. table here. <laughs> You're going to flip your opponent's lid. You're going to flip two of them, Ooh. score a point. The idea is you want to score four points to win the game. But very she's competitive. I know. She's cheating because she's hidden it. She's not watching it like it's supposed to. It says right on the box that this is a competitive game for competitive people. Uh -huh. And I think we're seeing that she here. Is. You gotta cheat. I'm a cheat too. Well, he didn't say he had to stay down here. Well, you, you have to flip, that, right? Hey, you, know? yeah, you gotta Let's flip, right? Yeah. All you can't bets do are this. off. Uh, I just try to get get going. Uh, okay, we can right. keep doing this forever. <laughs> All right, All that's right. what I like. Last one. So this is from Kinetics. These are Kinetics tiles. It's a company from Australia that's run by educators. This is a new spin on the classic magnetic tile play. This is the 50-piece transport set. Mm -hmm. So you're gonna get three different base chassis here, and you get to build your vehicles. Oh, mm -hmm. And of course. You know, what do, what do kids really like to do? Yeah, exactly. Just, exactly. Just knock them all down. And yeah, start but on. But and they this connect. This is open ended imaginative play. And again, they're learning about engineering, building structures. You know, there, there's a little bit of, you know, connect and retract type of thing. Yep. And also, too, you mentioned satisfying with the yeah. light bright. These have this unique bevel to the pieces. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Like very fidgety at your desk or something. You're on the yeah, call. Yeah, and, and then you uh, probably put lights on them and watch the lights diffract you and do all, all kinds, kinds of, of things. Stuff with oh, that. That's just well, see, when you were thinking about uh, National Unplugging Day, I was thinking board games. Yeah. And board games, of course, are still hot, and you'll find Pickleball Blast in the board game oh, aisle. Oh, yeah. Okay. Okay. Um, but, uh, you know, there's so many different ways. So it's like, you know, we always hear, think outside the box. Well, this is really outside the box. Yeah. This is a way to get the family playing together without being, you know, on the constant yes. devices, yes, 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 you yes. know, checking the TikTok, whatever. Well, let me ask you this. Are these games actually really popular? Yes. I mean, okay, because I, I would think that people have gotten away from it once we have the iPads and, no, they, and the um, phones. The, so the U.S. toy industry, um, it's believed, uh, is about a $40 billion industry. Oh, and okay. about 76% about, uh, of it's actually tracked. 
and that comes out to about 28 billion. Okay. And that's physical toys. Physical, physical toys. So okay. yeah, so families are still playing together. Yeah. So don't believe the hype when they okay. say you know okay. the kids are just on the iPads and stuff. Yeah. Of course they can be if the parents let, let them. Let them. That's a grown up thing. Small windows. And something like Lego, you uh. know, kids and adults do that. Yeah. This we saw how you know it doesn't matter the age you the can have bright. fun with it. We lay on the light floor, bright. all of them spread out on the floor and yes. go to town. And that's a that's a toy people have been playing with since the 60s. Mm. Yes. And they just keep making it better. Yeah, and better. very cool. Okay, so we just still have fun. I'm sitting here playing with I these myself. Playing. <laughs> the toyinsider.com is where you can find more information on these toys and other great things out there to keep the kids off the screens as much as you can, right? All right. Yes. Thank you so Thank much. You, so Steve. fun. All, All right. Unplug.